after I think maybe 18 months of not working, I finally went to an open mic mm -hmm. and I did okay. And then I went to maybe two or three more. And the last one I went to in that phase, I bombed so badly that on the way home, I started, I was like, I'm going to look for a job as soon as I get home. Mm -hmm. Indeed, I went back to work for a year. Uh, I took a job with a company that I wasn't actually super excited about. I just sort of took a job because I thought I needed a job. I needed an answer to the question, what do you do every day? Mm -hmm. And I did it for a year and, you know, nine months into that year, it became really clear that there were problems at the company that I was never going to be able to fix. And uh, I knew I had to leave. And after that, I just had to be really clear with myself to say, there's nothing else I would rather do. I'm going to fail at times. I'm going to succeed at other times. And in fact, the more you fail, especially in comedy, the better you get. Because the only way you learn new material and develop new material is by taking risks and by risking that the new joke isn't going to work as it often does not. And mm -hmm. you have to develop not just the empirical thought, but the emotional attitude that I'm going to fail and it's good for me and that's okay. And that, that failing, that bombing isn't failing. Bombing mm -hmm. and failing are different things.